What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here, and we are prepping some end timers for the terrible winter out on the chaos wastes. And we're also about to start working on some exterior wallage, considering how bad it went the first time. I would like granite chunks, but uh, there's not many around. We might just have to deal with what we have to deal with. Let's uh, jump into the granite here. There we go. All right, so structure complete. This is limestone, which is strength 540. It's pretty solid. How much limestone do we have? 122. I think we can get the job done with that. So there. Nope, we cannot get the job done with that. <laughs> but that's okay. For now, we'll just get a get a start. Rainy thunderstorm. That might not be the best spot for our door. Well, we're going to want a door. Let's see. Go like that. Go like this. Orders. Back to structure. Sorry. There we go. So we'll have a couple doors, and then we'll run this bad boy out like that. Now, it would be extremely wise. We'll have a trap here. Nothing here. A trap here. A door. Oops. Damn it. <laughs> so a trap. Nothing. Trap. Nothing. Boom. Trap. Nothing. Trap. Nothing. This is a method to prevent us from stepping on our own traps. That should be good for now. That'll get us two, three, four, five, six, seven traps. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Let's do that. And maybe we can tame this a little bit. Maybe it's too far out. We'll get these guys moved. So yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think we'll get rid of this. There'll be one on the end. They can run around and fix it. Okay. What's the situation? The cotton's coming in super slow. They have all this food that needs to be hauled, though. Relaxing socially. Well, when you're done... Why don't you move this rice in for us? How's this fella doing? Hmm. Well, he's healing up. Jeez, rare thrombos. I should redo that instead of rare thrombos. It's like, you know, some kind of Warhammer critter. It could be fun. Oh, he just barges right in, man. Don't don't hesitate. I think he's moving like that because everybody's asleep. So. Oh, a wild woman, you say. Is her name Aborto? Aborto, you have to be kidding me. Bio, too smart, chemical fascination, night owl. No health conditions. So, she's one mighty crafter. And decent at melee. Decent at intellectual and medical. She's actually pretty pretty decent overall. Let's see. We are working on this cat who is chemical, chemical fascination. Not a crafter. He's got a nice broad range though. Um, Shoot. We don't really have any clothes right now. Anyways, we could strip this dude and just cut him loose. I guess. He's a really good pawn though. He's an optimist. He's beautiful. Ten this chemical fascination thing blows, but super immune, too smart, nimble. You are a fast walker, beautiful, careful shooter, and you are beautiful chemical fascination underground. That'd give us two people with chemical fascinations. Um, yeah, we have two meals left. Maybe we should cook some more. You know, I think we should cut this dude loose. That's what I think. Because that didn't go down by a single point. He's eating food. 
Winter is going to be upon us soon. To get all Ned Stark on you. Alright, so let's tame her and see what happens. She's not as good as he is, but uh, we may not have to feed her for a hundred years. Hmm. Jeez, the question is, do we really want to? I guess we could make another bedroom over here somewhere, but... <laughs> She's not going to pair up with anybody, and he would. Man, I don't know. You know what? Forget it. Just get by with our three people for now. I think that's fine. All right. So they are moving our stuff around. So let's get the cooking stuff put in. We'll butcher. We'll do that. We will cut stones. Where's the stone scraps? Way over there. I don't know what that room's going to be. This room's pretty big, but we're going to put our table in there. And I... Ah, not there. I think we'll build a bigger, fancier table at some point, too. But for now, we just have to figure out how to survive this winter. After the way last game went, perhaps... I'm being a little too concerned about it, <laughs> but uh, I guess we'll see. There, get that stuff all set up. Can to reclaim our wood from here and here and here when we get desperate, which we most certainly will. Aha! Uh -huh. Well, they exited the map healthy. That's great. We are cooking up some meals. Hey, we have potatoes coming in. No, that big bastard's eating our potatoes, I think. You son of a... Alright. Hmm. If we brought him down... We're not bringing that dude down, right? <laughs> we can't shoo him out of here. What the hell is going on over here? Who's this? Did you dig up a grave? No. Oh, no. Are you a cannibal? You, no, you're just starving. You have to be shitting me. She literally dragged a body in here and ate it. Yeah. Yeah, she did. Well, if she goes berserk, we're going to have to kill her. Sadly, this thing would beat the crap out of her. I'd piss that thing off. Dude, it's just going to eat all of our food. <laughs> this, this thrumbo is a real jag-off. Well, hopefully we're going to have enough. Where? What are you working on? You're working on the walls. We certainly can't... Look at this thing. It eats like nobody's business. Can we harvest this stuff? Yes. Orders. Let's just be done with it because uh, it's going to eat us out of house and home regardless. So... Yeah, come eat the rice, please. The potatoes get a higher yield. Where are you guys going? Oh, there's steel over there somehow. What's over here? How the hell is there steel everywhere? I have no idea. Once we get our traps up, and we'll trap this jerk. Oh, a Bordeaux got sick. Must be food poisoning. Ha! <laughs> At least it didn't happen to me for once. Uh-oh, now Earth is sick. Great. <laughs> Um, yeah. We're low on steel. Oh, we got some potatoes laying around. Where are you headed? You're stargazing. Yeah, I want somebody to focus on this before that big dummy comes and eats them. Or a boar to oh, who thinks... First off, she can just eat my freaking potatoes. What a jerk. Maybe we will tame her. Ugh. No, I don't want... Needs. I don't want a pawn that's in that miserable of a situation. <laughs> She'll probably... No, it's not that cold out. Alright, everybody's asleep. I wish this thrumble would bug her off. Alright. Let's re replant all the cotton that got eaten by a dumb big animal. Harvest botched. I tell ya. I'm not even gonna watch it. It's so frustrating. Are we out of those blocks? We are, so we need to switch to something. I guess we'll go granite next. Yeah, this one probably doesn't have enough to finish. No. 
we have 40 granite so that'll get us 80 we should really bury that body all right so one two three four five six six times five is only 30 so I guess we cancel a big run of this 30 40 50 60 70 80 if she doesn't botch any and then I guess we go on to sandstone or slate <laughs> either is terribly exciting I guess we'll go slate at the end there there and we're gonna need some steel that's for sure fortunately we have this huge vein of it down here man these buttholes are just eating everything there's a zero percent chance you are a real son of a bee oh cause this guy eats it so she runs back to replant Jesus. And this dude. The Thrumbo literally ate all of our crops. If we die, it's because the Thrumbo will have killed us. We're going to jack up a Bordeaux if she tries that. Man. No. Her knees are just too horrible. I wish she's a Night Owl. That'd be nice. <laughs> God, did she get over the food poisoning? All right. We'll have a go. You. And you get all that hauled in before somebody steals it. Because these jerks. Tame failed. Oh, it's a pretty good chance, too. Hmm. I'm not sold on that, man. All right. Now, how do we get rid of this butthole? A meteorite of gold ore. Oh, that's why it's so tiny. Jerk. Alright, where's Four Eyes? She's the only one that actually accomplishes anything around here. Uh, let's... When you're done... Oh. You're actually gonna do it? No. So that means you can't construct out here. What was this? This was granite okay I think I seriously miscounted what what we could do with the granite somebody is on a major break risk how about that and that I don't know how this already got damaged so bad and you needs something the cold hmm we're actually doing the mining we left some overhead mountain over here another wild person jeez termite sickly and pretty no health conditions no gear you know we could easily get both of these people if we wanted them <laughs> This dude's a decent fighter. He's good at medicine. We don't really need any of those skills. I don't want to have to build another bedroom because we're not really going to have the wood to heat what we have here. They're already sleeping in the cold. And we can start by roofing up part of this to see if it gets too hot for us. Oh. Eight raw food. I wish this thing would just leave before we get it closed in here. Eventually it'll go over all of our traps and maybe it'll co go down and then we can eat it. Alright, look at that. They're finally moving the kitchen. Freaking fantastic. Four eyes is now sick. Great. Oh look, he's leaving. Termite is hunting four eyes. Where the hell is termite? Well, that's interesting. I wish you would have went for... Oh, shit. 
You got her too. You bunghole. Look, he's wounded all three of them. Alright, health. What a jerk. Needs mind shattering pain. Well, don't come wandering in here, you jago. Well, now we need another grave. Hmm. Alright, it is what it is. She's just sleeping one off here. Alright, I think Earth is our dock. Should get to tending everybody. What do we end up with? Potatoes. 318. That's pretty solid. Why aren't you tending? You are. And good thing we didn't sell our meds, people. Okay, so we built too much roof. <laughs> because it's too hot in the bedrooms. So let's... Uh, Let's remove a little bit. Yeah, it's too hot everywhere. Human revenge. What a bunghole. Oh, she's not moving too quick. Oh, she has food poisoning on top of it all. That's fantastic. All well, our rights will be ready again. If this dude, this person stressed, eats our rice. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. <laughs> Don't do it. I mean, we could give her this as a bedroom. Yep, there, look, eat our, eating our rice. No, harvesting our rice. Really? You have a brass set on you. We can't even take one person down. Oh, look, our cotton's coming in. Well, that's awesome. We can actually get some legit clothes. We should just pen this person up somewhere. Did, our, did everything get built? No. She must have botched construction down here. Ah, uh, whatever. Damn this person. Alright. That's it. Protecting our crops, man. Down you go, Aborto. By Sigmar, we won't have this crop theft happening any longer. Beautiful. As you were. Oh man, we beat her up really bad. We cut her fingers off. Well, now we're going to need another grave. So much for her. She was a decent pawn. I'll say that. Alright, you self tended. Are you wounded from that assault? You are not. Okay. Four eyes. Major break risk. We have dead bodies laying around. Somehow our walls got beat up. We have a slate wall over there that never got built. She's going to snap. Mm -hmm. Needs. Well, you should go recreate then. Abordo's going to croak. Take that, you crop stealing. We should have just killed it right away, I guess. The old world is a harsh place, man. You can't be playing games with people's rice. She's dead now. Can I get you? No. What about you? So we essentially have one constructor. Yeah, because you guys are zero. <laughs> Alright, so you... Nobody even has a passion. Alright, you over here. It's going to take her all day to build those, but... We have to get these bodies buried, man. Four Eyes is in bad, bad shape. Oh, I'll be damned. She did it. Wasn't so bad either, now was it? Ugh. Piss. <laughs> well, where are you going with that guy? Oh, good. Well, both bodies got moved. That's fantastic. Four Eyes. Health. Yes, she's totally better. Now if we could just get some freaking light in this base. Our rice is all over the place in terms of growth. Our cotton is damn near harvestable. What do we got? It's the end of summer, so we have some months left. When we get that first cold snap, though, 
I'm going to have to pull all that rice out of the ground. Why are we not building this? There you are. Beautiful. Now, this one, well, once we get our trap set up, first we need steel. So we're going to have to have her go mine steel. Where are you headed? Oh. Oh, nice. She's going to carry it back, too. So, I think we're going to deconstruct these things. Mostly because we need as much wood as we can possibly get. Earth is fully healed. Earth has made way more meals than we're going to eat. Because, <laughs> damn it, Earth. Oh, she made one more to keep in her pocket. <laughs> yeah, see, we just got a bunch of extra wood back. And then we can rebuild that out of whatever we have over here. Marble? What is that? Marble. Beautiful. And we're going to make steel doors. So we need a tailor bench. We need steel. That's what we need. I keep saying of what we need. Sadaku, not having a good day. Yeah, we really need steel. So four eyes, I think, is also our miner, right? No. Sadaku. Earth. We're going to get earth mining. That's all there is to it. Starvation. Sadaku. Well, so these are only going to last a few days. Let's close this. This room does not need the attention. And then that means we need to close this one as well. So this one should get cold, like outside. Or maybe not entirely. This one we can hold open. The bedrooms are hot. <laughs> Whenever this thing goes off, it gets crazy hot in there. Oh yeah. Ah, whatever. How you feeling over here, Sadako? I should give them nice empire names. Oh my word, malnourished. Well, guess what you could have done? Not snapped. Oh, she was a friend of Termite and a Porto. Oh God, both of those people. Rice plant died from rotting. Oh, because of roof. So it's not growing, it starts rotting. Splat. Oh well. Well, two of our three people are asleep. <laughs> Sidaku here. Just milling about. Earth's gonna keep playing that section. Despite the rotting. Alright, good. So, oh, group of travelers. Don't imagine. Look at how much faster Borba is than Lamb. No, no, she caught up. It's whenever they go at an, at an angle. Oh, yeah, see, you have a bad back and you're just fine. Alright, so we need enough steel for like eight traps. A bench to make apparel on. And what else? Do you have nothing to do? Relaxing socially. Hmm. Cutting stone block. Okay. I think I'm going to get her to mine. Ah, she's just not a miner. Exhaustion. Good. Finally go down. Look at this. <laughs> she's just... just Empty. Nothing. She's got no, she, her recreation's pretty good, actually. She's not going to make it back. She's just going to fall over. Don't get food poisoning. Dear God. So you ate, right? You're full? Yes, okay. All right, well, Sadako is back. Beautiful. Four Eyes is making stones. So production. I think we're going to prioritize security. over the production bench. There you go. So that's 35 times 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, good. We'll have some overhead mountain here that we absolutely must fill. Well, if we're 
we're not sleeping in the cold. We're sleeping in the heat. Let's see how that treats us. Oh, now it's super cold. It went from like 90 to 54. <laughs> Alright, well we can... Build the roof area, I guess. Ah, uh, look, Sanaku getting back to work. Needs Catharsis 40. Yes, thank you for uh, increasing there, Mr. Mood. What's this? This is our animal sleeping spot for the poor kitty that we had to kill way early on. This. So we can reinstall this somewhere else. If we get enough blocks, we can put floors in. Moods will improve when they have nice bedrooms. <gasps> Look at this. This is very exciting. Alright. Traps. We are about to be secure, man. So with this, we can hold open. What are you doing? You're doing a walk. Okay. I need her to recreate, and I don't want anybody else snapping on me, so... Should have come out here and mined this thing. I just want this to be held open so when she's done screwing... Oh, good. She'll do it on her own. Back to ignoring her. Yeah, we do have overhead mountain there. Getting rice again despite the stupid thrombo. And that stupid human showed up and started eating everything. Okay. So, 72, 72... 72 outside <laughs> there's somewhere there's got to be a happy medium with how to set that stupid thing up and Taylor bench well this is a storeroom this can be a workroom I guess this I want to leave up here because the blocks are up here and we're also gonna Suspend this one, re-enable that one. I don't care if it's granted anymore. We'll probably... I don't know what to fill this in with. I guess stone block is a renewable resource, so we should use stone block. There we go. Look at that. Secure. Nobody's getting in this baby. That includes thrombos that want to eat all of our freaking food. So, where's our overhead mountain? Mm-hmm. And I think we're just going to do sand sandstone here because it's the crappiest. Uh, is it the crappiest, though? <laughs> Let's see. Limestone's solid. Granite. Slate's pretty crap. What do we have for slate? We can do three. Whoa. That was way too much force. We'll do slate for there. Now we can use this as a storeroom. And this is whatever the hell. <laughs> but we already have a hanging out room. Which is awful. The bedrooms are awful. This one has blood in it. So that's not helping the situation any. Temperature outside is pretty cold. So let's see. Can we put up some more roof here? In this room we don't care if it stays cold. Alright, so now, what's the verdict? Well, temperature spikes nicely, but... It goes up to 90. Another chunk of roof. Did we fail? What happened? Oh no, we're good. And what do we say was next? Sandstone. Last thing we need is a freaking insect infestation. That's going to be extremely hard to deal with in the medieval times. Now also, we better get a couple more crops. Hey, visitors. Items to trade. I could come out and fill these. And there's our freaking cold snap. So there goes our cotton. I knew it was going to happen. It happens every time. Climates like this where you have a hard time growing stuff. They just wait to drop that on you. So then the question becomes, 
when do we start the harvest? <laughs> it's dropping fast. Let's just do it now. I want the cotton first, but I want everything. So you just have to watch them, and if they start, set them down here to start working like that. What the hell was that? Alright, so you have to turn down the grow. <laughs> turn up the plant cutting. There, that worked just fine. And it is in the 20s. You, come down here. Alright, we need parkas, tribal wares, toques. Hopefully we have enough out of all this. I wish we had some wake up, but wake up did not exist in the middle ages. <laughs> yep, there goes the plants. Good thing we're... No, no, no. They left us gifts. Oh, a nice hat. Any chance Four Eyes is our talker? Well, you could be. Go over there. You guys have a job. And it's called... Resting. No, it's not called resting. It's called getting all these plants harvested before they die. I already saw a bunch of them die. This is going to be a little tedious. I think we had this problem last time, but... Anytime you're in this kind of biome, it's rough. We're going to get all this done before I let them go to bed. So there's a good chance they're going to get upset with me. The rice is just dying in droves. So is the cotton now. Oh, we caught her. We can sell these junky steel knives and wooden clubs. Um, we're not selling our cloth. We did get a fair amount. We could buy their pemmican, which isn't going to last us very long. I'll buy their medicine. All their pemmican. Don't you dare leave it out there, four eyes. Alright. Nope, 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 nope. It's probably about break time anyways, but... Here, maybe I'll do this and come back to you. Okay. We are botching some harvest. I was just reflecting to myself how that hadn't really happened too much. So anyways, next time we'll see about getting some proper clothes made for the winter. These have to be hauled with huge priority. This one's full. We're going to expand it. And not into the doorway. And we're going to lose all of our food. <laughs> so... It is what it is. The moods are too crappy to do anything here. It's too cold in the bedrooms. Now if we roof this over. Like so. Let's see. What does that get us? It's still 30. Okay. So it shoots up pretty high. Nobody's going to freeze to death, but no one's going to be happy. Anyways, we lost all of our plans. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. If you're enjoying this, give me a like. If you have any comments, go ahead and leave them. The uh, dwarf mod is still progressing and is coming along very nicely. So uh, stay tuned for that. I'll do a playthrough when I get that done. I'm about to finally start playtesting that mod after working on it since December. So it's going to be pretty awesome. In the meantime, the base mod here coming along pretty great. I think I have all the bugs nailed out. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.